and gotta say, I spent the whole day outside yesterday for for Mother's Day. I hope I was hopeful I was gonna get a suntan, but you know, <laughs> <laughs> can't go wrong with being outside. That's right. Did you get any cupcakes for your Mother's Day, Sarah Beth? I didn't, but I did have brunch and a barbecue, so I would Perfect. say I'm very full today. Yeah, that's a very, very, very lovely Mother's Day. Hopefully everyone uh, celebrated appropriately yesterday with that nice weather. We have a little bit of rain returning. It fell most of it overnight. I think we're in pretty good shape this morning with just a few light sprinkles left over for the northern half of our area, maybe perhaps the Adirondacks and Seaway Valley with most of that left. But it's not much. It's very light. And I think temperatures aren't bad either, so it shouldn't be too awful of a start to your work week at 50 in Plattsburgh, 48 degrees in Burlington, 42 Montpelier and Newport, Saranac Lake even at 40 degrees still and 45 in Rutland. Here's the rest of your day here. We're going on back up towards that 60 mark. I don't think it's going to be quite as warm as yesterday. Definitely not quite as much sunshine. However, we might get lucky and get a few peaks of that sun, but do keep an eye out for a few more of those stray showers. They're going to be scattered in nature. Uh, not anything super heavy or widespread, but something to have in mind through the rest of the afternoon, especially if you have plants to be outside. So yes, a few sunny moments, which will be nice, but do know that a few of these showers show up on and off throughout the rest of the day. I think pretty quiet tomorrow morning, uh, similar temperatures, probably in the 40s tomorrow morning with a little bit of sun. And then yet again through the afternoon as the system, uh, a very weak one sits to the north of us. It's going to just push a few more of those scattered showers into our area. Don't rule out a little isolated thunderstorm with a few of those for the northern half of our area. But for the most part here, it's just some clouds that will uh, produce a few of those showers and some sun in between. Then Wednesday, our rain chances continue to diminish. However, worth mentioning, a few of those stray showers might show up, but I think a little bit more sun in the forecast by then. Temperatures are below average for a couple more days today, near 60 or so, 56 so on Tuesday, upper 50s on Wednesday. But from there, that back close to, if not even past average, mid and upper 60s expected for Thursday and Friday and some sunshine for both of those days, which will be great. A few spot showers, worth mentioning a few of those showing up on Friday evening. Similar again on Saturday evening, might find a couple on Sunday. However, when it comes to our rain chances, really over the next several days, it's not going to be much and it's nothing super substantial. Plus, we'll be flirting with 70 for both Saturday and Sunday, something to look forward to.